Well, hello there, folks. Right, I'm going to do something next message up after this one on the overlap. I think it's called the overlap. The thing with Neville, Carragher and Keane. Um, I watched the second episode only last night. It was on probably two, three weeks ago now. But I'm behind the curve there. I'm only just catching up. But I've seen something that I thought I must bring up today. I must do. Because I've mentioned, who have I mentioned in the past? I've mentioned Blondie, but more specifically Debbie Harry. And I've also mentioned old Lionel Richie. They've both done performances on the TV recently at big events. Lionel sounded awful. I didn't realise he was that bad anymore. He sounded awful. And I thought he had a great voice and I thought he'd still be able to cut it. Debbie Harry sounded woeful. And I mean woeful. Really, really poor. And I've been calling for her to retire and walk away. Because she's got a legacy to protect and she's spoiling it. As I say, you're only as good as your last performance. The last two I've seen of hers have been absolutely shocking. Can't sing anymore. Talks through the songs. Doesn't phrase anything correctly. Awful. Seen something on the overlap last night and it's funny. Before they came on, you'll know what I'm on about if you've seen it. They only shown about 20 or 30 seconds of this song. But before they came on, I thought, this is going to be terrible. Because I've seen these probably two maybe even three years ago now. It might have been on the Jules Holland show. It might not have been, but they were on some programme and the boy can't sing anymore. And I'll tell you what it was. If you've not seen it, go on the overlap, rewind it all the way to the end and look for the last couple of minutes of the programme. Dex's Midnight Runners come on doing Come On Eileen. I say, go away, Eileen. I don't want to hear from you again. Absolutely shocking. Absolutely, he cannot sing anymore to save his life. Now, I know we might be getting on a bit. Many are. He may even have had an accident and been ill. I don't know. If he's been really ill, I can understand it more, possibly. Because it might be the after effects of him being ill. If he's not been, he's got no excuse at all. Come on, Eileen is not the hardest song in the world to sing. It doesn't require great chops, as they say. There's no really, really high or really, really deep notes or anything like that. So if you can sing it reasonably when you're 20, 25 or 30, you'll sing it just as reasonably at 60, 65 and 70. Is it old Kevin Rollins? Can't sing it to save his life. He talks through most of it. I would suggest he's not got any power in his voice anymore. Not his, lung, his lung capacity's gone. That's what made me think, has he been ill? I don't know. But it's woeful. And it's a shame because they were a great band. Well, I say great band. I only know three or four of their songs, the hits, you know. But I loved them. Great. Good showman. No problem at all. Nice music. Liked it. But oh my God, it's shocking now. And I would imagine most of the band behind him were original members. They must be playing along thinking, oh my God, keep your heads down, keep your heads down. Or I can do my bit. <clears throat> I can do my bit. I wonder why Kevin can't do his. They must realise they're stealing a living. They must realise how bad they sound. Because if the singer sounds bad, the band sounds bad. It's as simple as that. He was absolutely terrible. As I say, only 20, 30 seconds shown on the TV. It was awful. And it's his most iconic, most well-known song. And as I say, he's not really high parts in it or really deep parts. So if he can't sing that song when he's probably sung it 300, well, probably 3,000 times during his lifetime, if he can't sing it now, he's never going to sing it ever again. Retire. Walk away, Kevin. Hang up the old mic on the mic stand. Walk away. You can't do it no more. I'm surprised fans of his, and there'll be some fans that come in here, that you pay to watch him again. I, I'm, I can't believe people will part with money to listen to someone talk through his songs, because that's all he does. There's no singing involved at all, and when it is, it's not on the money. It really isn't. Very, very poor. 